the bold and the beautiful spoilers for Friday, November 15th. Tease that Ridge Forrester. Thorsten K. will be busy fussing with a dress on one of the Forrester models when Steffi Forrester, Jacqueline McInnes Wood, arrives. Ridge will reveal that it's Thomas Forrester's Matthew Atkinson design. Ridge and Steffi will then discuss Thomas, wondering why he wasn't there for the fitting. As it turns out, neither Ridge nor Steffi will have heard from Thomas, and Ridge will relay that he didn't see him or Douglas Forrester, Henry Joseph Samiri, at the Forrester mansion this morning. But Ridge later learned that Douglas was at school today. Once they're back in the CEO office, Ridge will reassure Steffi, who's concerned about the safety of the situation in the storage area. They'll discuss Thomas once again, and Ridge will voice his concern that Hope Logan, Annika Noel, will push him until he signs the adoption paperwork. He'll then leave Thomas a phone message. Meanwhile, on the new episode of BB on Friday, November 15th, at Brooke Forrester's, Catherine Kelly Lang Mansion, Hope will still be reeling from her memories of Thomas falling into the vat of acid, and she'll try texting Thomas again. Afterwards, Brooke will arrive, and Hope will be distraught thinking that she killed Thomas. Liam Spencer, Scott Clifton, will then arrive and announce that Beth Spencer, River Davidson and Madeline Valdez, is with the babysitter. He'll notice that something's off with Hope and will want to know what's going on. And he'll mention that he wants to know what happened with Thomas last night. He'll be shocked when Hope tells him that Thomas signed the adoption papers and that she now has shared custody of Douglas. Brooke will offer reassurance and will ask him to relay to Bill that they're happy about the change. Liam will wonder if Hope's really okay, but eventually he'll leave. After Liam's gone, Hope will tell Brooke that she can't lie to Liam, and she'll reiterate that Thomas is dead and she's responsible for it. Brooke will tell her that they'll get through this, but Hope will think that Douglas may never forgive her. Brooke will remind Hope that she was only trying to protect Douglas and that what Thomas did was sick. Hope will wonder how everything went so wrong, and she'll relive the events of the previous night before once again breaking down. Brooke will note that they need to figure out what to do now, and Hope will conclude that she needs to confess what happened to Ridge. Needless to say, Hope Logan, Annika Noel, has certainly turned into a much worse version of the man that she so desperately tried to escape. Thomas Forrester, Matthew Atkinson. And boy have the tables turned in less than a few short months. It now looks like Hope is the one who is acting dangerous and unhinged, to the point that she might be even willing to kill someone in order to get things done her way. Bold and the beautiful spoilers tease that Ridge is going to put a stop to this. However, 
Little does he know that Brooke Logan, Catherine Kelly Lang, is fueling the fire even more by covering for her daughter. While Hope has managed to become Little Douglas Forrester's, Henry Samiri, new legal mother, Thomas Forrester, Matthew Atkinson, is missing and Ridge wants answers. But whether or not he will get them remains to be seen. Soap fans are not strangers to having their favorite programming interrupted for wild weather reports, natural disasters, and high-speed pursuits, sometimes depending on what part of the country you're in. This time around, daytime fans nationwide will encounter preemptions this week due to the live coverage of the House's first open impeachment hearings for President Donald Trump. Here's what we know so far. The first hearing of the House Intelligence Committee's hearing is scheduled for 10 a.m. EST on Wednesday, November 13th and the second is scheduled for Friday, November 15th at 11 a.m. EST. All major networks including ABC, CBS and NBC will follow the proceedings live. Which means that we should expect interruptions when the young and the restless, the bold and the beautiful, general hospital and days of our lives are set to air. Daytime viewers are used to drama, so it should be no big deal when our favorite shows are pushed around a little to the left or right, right? Not so. Many fans, myself one of them, are a little peeved to have to make adjustments. Of course, it makes very little sense on one hand, since we will eventually see the content, one way or another. But for those of us who don't like change, tweaking our routine is something we can do without thank you very much. Then again, there must be millions of fans who don't mind preemptions one bit. Are you one of them? We'd love to hear your opinion on this topic, along with any survival tips you may have. The bold and the beautiful spoilers reveal that Shauna Fulton, Denise Richards, once Brooke Logan Forrester's, Catherine Kelly Lang, life. However, the Vegas vixen isn't vindictive. The actress recently explained what is going through Shauna's mind and heart. Speaking to Soap Opera Digest, Richards explained that Shauna comes from Las Vegas and didn't have the easiest life. Suddenly, she comes to LA and experiences people who live a lavish lifestyle. This is tempting for her, as it would be for anyone who was not used to it. The bold and the beautiful spoilers indicate that while Shauna's interest in Ridge at first was due to his money, it has gone further. She sincerely cares for the man and admires him being there for his children no matter what. She feels that it is the one thing they have in common. Their love for their children. No matter how badly they screw up. One interesting statement from Denise's interview was Shauna wanting Brooke's life. At the same time, Richards doesn't feel that Shauna's flirtation is vindictive. Well, I think Shauna wants Brooke's life. I think she has seen what it could be like. 
and has been exposed to a very lavish lifestyle. But I think aside from all of that, she genuinely feels a connection with Ridge.